with simulations because it doesn't allow for interior boundaries. Okay, it, uh, it's called, it will only deal with the constant coefficient Poisson problem. Um, and that requires something we commonly use that's called preconditioned conjugate gradient. Uh, again, I'm just throwing a lot of terms at you. They're, they're linear algebra methods, okay? Trouble with PCG for scalability. And we really want to use all of the, the power of our computer. So when you buy a computer today, you get a, one processor. But inside that processor, they're typically a bunch of little processors. But the way software is typically written, it uses only one of those processors, right? So we like to develop algorithms now that are good at using all of the processors that you pay for. Um, so cores are idling, that's bad. We don't want to do that. All right, so our design requirements for this solver that I've developed, we want to have support parallelization for multi-core systems. Uh, we want to use this fast Poisson solver method because it's got this n log n speed up factor. It gives me algorithmic speed up and nothing can beat that. Okay, and I want to target one billion voxels. What is one billion voxels? One billion voxels, if you imagine an image uh, that's 1,000 pixels by 1,000 pixels. And now imagine 1,000 of them. So that's, that's how, we com uh, how we deal with volume in, in a computational sense. So a billion voxels is a, is a volume of space that's divided into, into 1,000 by 1,000 by 1,000 little units. Great. All right, let's talk about liquid simulation. Pick and flip, um, again, methods that are, are, are very popular for doing um, fluid simulation uh, the, for liquids. Now, we want to do something else. We want to do this thing called a sure complement decomposition. I'll try to explain this, this mathematical technique. So, 